everyone and welcome back. Today I'm in the town of Willits, California and we're here at the Roots Motive Steam Festival and as you can see the trains coming. They got a steam shovel here, they got a steam roller, every steam donkey you can imagine ever made. And it's all here on display in the town of Willits, which is about 100 miles north of San Francisco, maybe a little more. So let's uh, come along and check all this equipment out. I like the old uh, logs they got there. And open cars. And a caboose. You don't see many cabooses anymore. Roots of Motive Power Steam Festival. Okay, we're on the train. And then I got my handy dandy ticket. Now this, uh, just to let you know, if you show up, the price is up to you. It's all donation. Here we go. This loops around the whole facility. Let's we'll see what we can see. Not a very long train. Guys, coming to collect our tickets. You got me. If you want it. Thank you. Got a happy face. And you are able to just start to see the steam shovels there warming up. Definitely gonna make our way to watch that because that looks pretty cool. Yeah, I think we're gonna make a beeline there over there after this is um, drops us off. This is a real short train trip. A 
they have the old bulldozers running too, it's like. And lots of little kids playing soccer. They have a, a program I saw online where you, for a hundred bucks you can come and operate one of these. Pretty amazing. That little digger there. Cool, does it? Looks like these kids are running the things themselves. I can tell you, I'd be very excited to do that when I was a little kid. Driven free hydraulics. You know what you notice around here? It's a lack of women. This is definitely a men's thing. There's a few, but the percent is probably 90-10. Look at that old international tractor. They got some really neat stuff here. One thing you can't smell is the smell. I got a Southern Pacific um, truck trailer. It's old ties, old track. Kind of old uh, pumping motor, looks like. Another shovel on the train. Look at that old locomotive there, number 53 CWR. Old diesel, that thing looks its part. Gotta love the sound of that. Huh? Like they're firing up all these old donkeys. They use these in the forest to uh, mill trees and cut trees down. They attach cables to them and drag logs to the forest. And they drag themselves. They wrap a cable around a tree and pull itself along. There's a lot of really neat stuff here to check out today. Office is even on a train. Robert Dollar Company. Coming back into the station. Keystone Driller. I wonder if they're going to demo that. I think we're going to make a beeline to the shovel right now, though. I think they're giving us two laps. This is that old... Because this thing, external pistons on the outside, drives the gear-driven drivetrain. That's pretty wild. Logging train. 
Maybe they'll restore this one someday. Well, what do you guys think so far? This is pretty awesome, huh? I mean, just not many places that just open their rail yard up and get everything running for you to check out. We have all this old rolling stock here. It's pretty cool. Check this thing out. Number two, Baldwin. Got a square housing on it. Like it's getting a little water. Okay, it looks like they're getting the Heisler filled up with water here. Now that is a beauty. It looks like the water line has a little bit of leaks going on. They got a pump. Number one. Manufactured by Heisler Locomotive Works, Erie, Pennsylvania. I love all the leaks they got in the hose. On a hot day, I'm sure they don't mind that. It's like some of these uh, tracks too, they never use. One of the things about the high split is the, the drive frame. You see the drive shaft? Okay, we're getting close to being full. Pump's about to be turned off. Passengers are waiting patiently. There goes the pump. Can't have a steam thing without water. I like how casual everybody is here. They're not saying, hey, stand back. Keep away. Don't get close. They encourage you to be involved in a safe distance. Looks like this thing is going to be ready to rock in a minute.
That is one cool train. Locomotive, locomotive. Too. I think I'll have to ride it again and try to get up in the caboose. There's a lot of action going on around here. Okay, back into the hot sun we go. They got a donkey here and they're making a big train connection. Locomotive connecting to the train that the number one high school just pulled away from. And they're bringing the number two Port of Olympia to connect.
storage area they have here. For this area. Producers and really old locomotives here. They're in need of major restoration. Hopefully they'll get the funding to do that. place is amazing especially if you're into trains and locomotives and anything steam as you can see there's a lot going on not that far of a drive up here in Willett so I highly recommend coming here if you can and if you can't and just watch a video and you live somewhere on the east coast or you live in another country thanks for watching Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you on my next video. Peace.